Hi folks and welcome back to OK Games. So, Bob, you've been challenged to a go-kart race. Do you know how to drive, right? OK, I'll take that as a no. This is a problem then, do you want me to help you? OK, let's see if I can do something for you. Like other times, we're gonna use neural network in combination with genetic algorithm to try and teach Bob how to drive a go-kart. So, I've set up a scene with an easy track, so Bob can get confident with his kart. How will it work? I'm going to spawn 150 go-karts to train Bob. If a go-kart goes out of the track, it will be destroyed and it won't move anymore. There are some checkpoints along the track, and every time a go-kart goes through it, it gains a point. After all cards have been destroyed, a new generation of cards will be created, but not from scratch, they will inherit the learning of their predecessor. In particular, I'm going to keep the behavior of the ones that have the highest score and randomly mutate the others. Doing this, I can make sure that the best cards will survive through the next generation. Here, in the top left, you can see the current generation, and in the right corner, the current highest score. Ok, let's start Bob's training. Bob? I thought you said you didn't know how to drive. How is it that you already complete this track in just one generation you didn't even... Oh god, ok, I see you are a quick learner. So let's try something more difficult. Let's make a new track for Bob. I'm gonna make it with more turns, and longer of course. And I'm gonna throw in some decorations, yeah, why not? Now that we have a new track ready, we can see if Bob can actually learn how to drive. Yes, this is the Bob I know, failing hard, but at the same time giving me something to be proud of. Well, let's leave him to his training and see how it goes after an hour or so. So, Bob has been training for a while now, and at generation 64 he's kinda able of completing the track without any issue. But I want him to train more, so let's force him to die, so a new generation can born. We are now at generation 84 and things are going good enough. A lot of cards can complete the track at least one or two times, but sometimes, in some dangerous turns, we lose someone. I like to think that they are sacrificing themselves for a greater good. After a few laps there are only these two guys remaining, and at this point I can safely say that Bob has learned how to drive a go-kart, and that he is ready for a real race. Before jumping into the race, I want to thank Mattia for the suggestion, it was really fun to try this. If you'd like to see Bob learning something specific, let me know in the comments, and I'll pick one and try my best to make it. Now let the race begin! As you see, Bob started ahead, he earned it after all. His opponents are yellow, green and blue. Yes, they don't have a name, you only have to cheer for Bob. Giving them a name might confuse you. Go Bob, hit that pedal! The final straight for the first lap. And at the start of the second lap, Bob is still in the lead. Gosh, look at those sick moves! Look with how much grace he is driving, he's eating alive with his opponents! Blue starts to fall in behind while yellow and green are really close to Bob. Will they overtake him? We're approaching the end of the second lap and Bob has regained some terrain, but yellow is still behind him and doesn't want to give up. 
This is the final lap. The final turns. Bob is approaching the final straight and ending the race. And he did it! Thanks to his amazing trainer, he won the race, of course. He has been in the lead for the entire competition. I wonder what he will learn next. Well, I hope you had fun, I sure had. Thank you for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe and challenge Bob with something, he's raiding for almost everything. That's all, see you next time.